Welcome back to my channel. My name is Tara. I like to make videos about uh, thrifting here in the Austin area and today I have a what sold video for y'all um, in the month of July. So sales have been pretty slow uh, in August. It seems like um, they were better in June and July. So I thought I would just kind of do a little recap on all the things that I sold in July. So first off is this gray sheath dress by J. Crew in a size six petite. I included the keywords interview, career, business, and it sold for $25 plus shipping. Um, the next item is this Umgi black ruffle pants, size large. Um, and these I actually had purchased when I was in San Antonio at a little shop. Uh, there on the river walk and they were, I bought them for $80 and I had tried them on and, um, they had also given us like little cocktail drinks. And I remember I spilt a little bit of my, um, what, a bloody Mary onto the pants and I tried them on and they did fit. Um, and I just kind of felt like I just, I wanted to buy them. So I ended up purchasing them, um, for 80 bucks and then every time I tried to put them on, they never really looked like I wanted them to. They, mostly they were too short. So I was really thrilled to finally sell them. I only sold them for $24 um, plus shipping. Next item is this Morona sailboat print sleeveless top in a size extra large. I also included blue in the listing and um, that's a Target brand. It sold for $10 pretty quickly, plus shipping. Um, next item is this Victoria's Secret blue denim studded shoulder tote bag. It had really nice pockets on both sides as well. It sold for $12. Um, next item is this Victoria's Secret bikini swimsuit top color block. Um, this item I had for a while, probably had for over a year, and I was really thankful that it finally sold. It sold for $11.99. Next item, this Express One Shoulder Knit Blouse with Ruffle Burgundy Size Large. This was in excellent condition. Um, I think I got this at the Goodwill Bins in Cyprus. Um, it only sold for $11, but that's fine. Next item, these were really cool. Disney by Tommy Bahama Jungle Jubilee 100% linen shorts. Um, these were in really good condition. I had looked these up and there were comps for like $40, $49. So I was able to sell these for $35. This item, Calvin Klein Bubble Blouse, pastel colors, size petite large, sold for $14. This Shein wrap dress in tomato red, sleeveless v-neck. Um, it had, I put drawstring, but it really had like a little wrap belt. It was super cute. It just always, I wore it a couple times. My sister had given it to me and um, it was just a little bit too big. So I ended up selling it for $12.75. Uh, these men's Levi's 505 jeans 31 by 32 I think my friend Tally gave these to me and they sold for 20. This Victoria's Secret uh Dream Angels push-up this was in excellent condition like it had never been worn before so pretty $18. Um this purse Nanette Lapore by Nanette Lapore shoulder bag crossbody adjustable strap um I sold it for 13 the woman who bought it from me um, started a return and then she told me that she shipped it to me, but it never, or she, um, yeah, she told it, told me that she shipped it and that I had sent her the label, but I never did that and I never received the purse back. So um, eBay ended up closing the return because it didn't show that she had ever shipped it back to me. So. Anyways, uh, next item, this Old Navy tie-dyed denim baby doll top acid wash size medium. This was so cute. I kind of liked it, but I felt like maybe it was a little bit too, um, like young looking for me. I like teenager-ish kind of like, you know, so I just 
sold it for $16.20. Um, this Ann Taylor Loft three quarter length sleeve, colorful tropical floral Hawaii print, um, kind of like little, it almost was like a sweatshirt material, sold for $13. Um, this self-watering planter ceramic ivy. This was really cool. It, it's got like a bowl in the, it's like two pieces and one goes in the other and it, you can put water in the outer piece and the plant soaks up the water from that. Sold it for $18, which I ended up having to spend some on packaging for it. I had to buy a box and like, um, bubble wrap. So I didn't really end up making that much. I think I purchased it for like $5 at the Goodwill store. Um, I, I did sell another one and I was like, okay, I'm not going to accept less than like $25 for it because the shipping is, um, kind of difficult. Finally sold this Michael Kors crossbody purse, Morgan animal print gold chain. This was in great condition. Um, I'm really glad it finally sold. I had a lot of interested buyers, $35, these women's athletic swim shorts, by Gecko. These sold very quickly for 18. This Stanley 24 ounce stainless steel ice flow aerolite water bottle. Um, I sold it for 18.75. This Victoria's Secret, uh, very sexy push-up bra in fuchsia pink, so pretty, sold for $18. I find a lot of Victoria's Secret bras here at the eBay stores anyway. Um, this cabbie women's top, large pinwheel geometric sleeveless sold for 12, 15. Um, oh, this, I did sell this BB gun. That was my boyfriend's. Um, I didn't test it and I should have, and apparently it didn't, it didn't work. So I apologized to the buyer and I was like, I'm so sorry. I don't normally sell items like this. Um, it was my boyfriend's and I just gave him a full refund shipping and everything. Cause I felt kind of bad that I had sold it to him not working. Um, this altered state coral orange sundress size large sold for 1350. Uh, this Easton baseball bag blue and black with handles. Um, this was my boyfriend's. It was in great condition. He had had it in his garage for a while and it was still in really good condition. Sold it for $14 right away. Uh, Victoria's Secret pink lacy bralette push up bright pink sold for $14. Um, these Express Women's shorts, dark wash size four. Um, I had these for a long time and they finally sold for 10. I got these at the bins in Cypress, Texas. Uh, this Athleta Teal Blue Workout Top Built-In Bra, size medium. This one I purchased at a eBay store. I want to say I paid like $12 for it too, and I sold it for $12. So that wasn't a great profit, but at least I made my money back. Um, this Ladies Loudmouth Skirt Skort, size 2 American Flag finally sold. I did have this for a long time and it didn't even sell. Um, like I thought it would probably sell in June before 4th of July. Uh, and it finally sold on July 29th for 20. And let's see, probably the last item. Yes. This is the last item that sold for the month of July. This French country rectangular metal wall clock. Um, this one, I purchased it at an eBay store probably for six or seven dollars and um, when I got it home it wasn't working so I just made sure to include that in my listing and um, yeah she didn't uh, complain or anything so I'm glad she saw that and it, it only sold for 19 which that one's another one where I'm kind of like think twice because of all the shipping included I did have to purchase a box for it and then um, some packing material and that is it that sold for the month of July. Um, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time.